Hey everyone, it's Laura and Trent. Happy New Year. I'm wearing my shirt. I'm so sad, you guys. In case you haven't heard, we lost Betty White today and I there were some tears. I was very upset. But we're gonna toast to her. And I thought it was fitting. This is a rose, you know, for rose. Um, this is from the Aldi advent calendar. It is a Moscato rose and it's delicious. And then I don't know if you can see, but Trent has some too. This is a, actually a shot glass, but there is actually some in there because <laughs> I didn't have anything else I could, you know, that was small enough for him. Right. But we've just been hanging out. He's been comforting me because I was sad. We went to Sam's club earlier today and five below just running some errands because we're supposed to get six inches of snow tomorrow so we were trying to like get groceries and everything today well plus a lot of stores are gonna be closed tomorrow so cheers everybody happy new year hoping for a better year oh here comes dolly she's gonna try to spill my wine don't do it just show you this calendar i got so Dollar Tree used to always have wall calendars and they haven't had any. So we went to Five Below and I saw this little SpongeBob one. This is going to be for my, my cubicle at work. Um, I just thought it was funny. <laughs> Weekend plans be like, <laughs> it's all SpongeBob memes. That's, that's February actually. There's January. I won't show you all of them, but running from my responsibilities like <laughs> that's about right i just thought it was cute so hang that up in my cubicle it was three bucks they really didn't have a lot of calendars there they had a what do you call it, little spinny things you know where the calendars were in there they had maybe six different ones um they had this one they had an nba one which we already bought um and then like a bunch of anime ones it's kind of disappointing. We asked them if they had any more and they said no. I'm like, well, SpongeBob it is for my office. Usually I get like a cat calendar or something silly like that. Oh, the cats are fighting. I'll show you, we got a, Ricky got a couple of little things at Burlington for the baby for Cairo. <laughs> Look at these little Jordan socks. Here are six pairs. Oh, they're so fuzzy in this one. They're so freaking cute. And then these are the other three. <laughs> we just thought they were so cute. $6.99. They're probably too big for him. He's tiny. Well, he's actually... So he was born in November. And he's already in like... He's starting to outgrow his zero to three month clothes. He's in three to six. And some of those are even a little tight. He's kind of chunky. But his feet are still little. So he won't be able to wear these for a little while. And then Ricky got him this. Look at this little Nike onesie. <laughs> little footy pajamas. It's so cute. How much was this? $10.99. And this is a nine month. So probably in a few months, we'll be able to wear this. A little chunky thing. It's so cute. So anyway, we've just been mellow, hanging out, uh, watching TV after we ran our errands and having some wine. Hanging with Trent here. The babies haven't been bothering him too much. Honestly, I don't know if they've even noticed him. Um, Coco hasn't really seen him. I think I was worried about her wanting to like get him, but I think because he's not a plush, I think she's not interested. If he was a stuffed animal, that would be different, but um, she's not really interested. I bet you Dolly would be, but she hasn't noticed him yet. So even though we've been sitting here watching TV together, we were watching the Golden Girls mar Marathon earlier on TV Land, you know, in honor of Miss Betty. And then they started showing Hot in Cleveland. And I love Betty White, but I don't like that show. I like the Golden Girls. So anyway, we'll probably watch some, I don't know, Ryan Seacrest or something to watch the countdown. And we took a very long nap today, like a three-hour nap after we got done at Sam's Club. So I'll definitely be able to stay awake till midnight tonight. It is where I'm, when I'm filming this right now, about 20 after 10 here um, in Central Time. So hope everybody is having a safe and happy New Year's Eve. Um, we never, pretty much never go out. I don't think we've gone out for New Year's Eve in like six years. It's just too crazy out there. So we usually stay home and 
Just have a little drink and relax. So that's what we're doing. Hope you're all doing well. And I, Trent and I will see you on my next one. Happy New Year. Bye-bye. Forgot to show my lippy of the day. Sorry. Okay. It is one of the Ulta ones that I got from the Ulta Lip Vault. And there's no shade name on it. It's a lip stain. And it looks like really like dark in the bottle. But it goes on like a pretty like pinkish color. So, okay. And it's not coming off as I'm drinking. See, there's none on my glass. So, all right. Happy New Year, guys. Bye-bye.